Hey everyone, I hope everyone's doing well today. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Kelty Versen. It is a 25 liter backpack. I am going to be giving you a 360 view of what it looks like. So everyone, let's dive in and see everything this backpack has to offer. So the first thing I do want to talk about is the suspension system on this backpack. It has a very nice and minimal suspension system, but very effective. It has very nice padding on the shoulder straps, very nice and thick padding for very added comfort on both sides. Very nice stitching as well. It, it is all triple stitched throughout. It also does have a very nice two back panel of mesh back here that is very nice and padded and in the center you do have an airflow system that lets air travel up and down so you are going to be very comfortable you're going to have very minimal sweat i have been using this backpack for a period of two months already and it works very well for hiking and even for everyday use so this is a very practical backpack for a lot of different uses okay everyone so let's take a look at the front of the shoulder straps on both sides you are going to see this elastic webbing that it does have and the reason for that is that you can put a hydration pack and run it either left or right side and you do have these daisy chains on the bottom on both sides and the reason for that as well is for the sternum strap it is removable you can remove it it does have a plastic clip here that you can remove and you can adjust it to a different size according to your body type and you do have these adjusters on the bottom that are very nice and very thick nylon as well and you do have a very nice grab handle and the grab handle does have mesh as well up here okay everyone so let's go ahead and talk about specs this backpack is made out of a 300d polyester which is water resistant so you are going to have to put a cover on it if you want to make it 100 percent waterproof it also does have a light reflector here that is hidden that you can put a light reflector. It does have a strap to put a light reflector. And the other thing it does offer is the Kelty branding down here is also reflective. And also here on the strap itself, this is also reflective as well. So this is really good if you're running or if you're hiking and you want to be visible, you're going to be able to be seen with these reflectors. So that is a very good option that they also put on this backpack. Uh, the other thing I do want to talk about is height. The height on this backpack is 20 inches tall and the width is 12 inches and the depth is 8 inches. And the pack unpacked is one pound eight ounces okay everyone so the first thing i do want to show you is the first pocket it does have it does have a lime green throughout for better visibility inside your pack it does have this first pocket here and i am going to be removing my wallet from there it does have this really nice mesh pockets for putting different stuff that you might need it has a small one here it has a medium sized one here and it has a larger one here and it also does have a small clip here for keys as well and it does have a really nice large pocket and like i said before this one is all lime green like that for better visibility at night you're going to be able to see all your content inside your pack so this is a top loading backpack Basically, all you have to do is just buckle this 
and open this up and over here on the lid it is going to have another zipper which is really good for sunglasses or if you want to put any type of cords or extensions for your cell phone or any other type of cords you might need or battery packs or anything this is going to be great for that very nice zipper pulls that it does have and on the outside of this it does have another zipper and this is where you can put your laptop here I do have a 15.6 inch laptop and it fits in here perfectly no problem uh, you can also use this pouch here that is really nice and padded as well you can use this for your hydration as well all you have to do is put your hydration bladder in here and then run your hose and you can run your hose either to the left side or you can run it to the right side so it's gonna work either way so that's a very plus on this bag as well now I am gonna go ahead and close this off and go through the main compartment this is a drawstring on this backpack all you have to do is just open up your drawstring and you going into your backpack this is a dump pouch system so all you have to do is just pull out your your whatever you're carrying in here so let me go ahead and take some of the stuff out to show you a little bit of the inside I do use this for my cameras that's why I got this bag as you can see the sleeve here for the laptop is nice and padded and it does have a smaller sleeve for putting in other flatter smaller things that you might need to carry and the rest is just a large dump pouch like I said so very nice very well made the only thing that I have a problem with in a critique with is this right here if you do not have this fully loaded and if it's just like this and if you just close it off like this it does have a tendency it doesn't matter how well or how tight you tie it, it does have a tendency while it's shaking, it will come out. So Kelty, please do something about this. Maybe you can put a little clip or something like that on there uh, where it can hold it in place where it won't come up, come apart while you're walking around. That's the only thing I found that I didn't have is fully loaded. When I have it fully loaded, it's fine because it holds it down. But if it's just, if you're just carrying a few things, this does have the tendency of coming off. Okay, everyone, so a really neat feature on this backpack, the side water bottle pouches. They do have a button here that you can buckle and you can open these up if you want to use these water bottle pouches for hiking. And you can put a 32 ounce Nalgene in here. It does fit very well in here. So you can stick a 32 ounce bottle in here, but if you're not using it, all you have to do is buckle it, say if you're in the city and you're not going to be using such a big water bottle pouch or you just want to have something small, all you have to do is just buckle it down and it hides nice and neat in here and you're ready to go and it does have these water bottle pouches on both sides so if you're going hiking and you need more room, all you have to do is expand them. So very cool. Okay everyone, so the Kill T Versa is a very nice backpack. The reason I got this backpack is I do carry my camera equipment pretty much everywhere I go just in case just to take a really nice shot, a really good shot. I do also spend a lot of time in the woods and I was looking for something where I could use it you know, for everyday purposes and also I could use it for hiking and stuff as well and I didn't have to carry such a large backpack. If you don't need to lug around of such a large backpack, 25 liters, this is perfect. So I really like the Kelty Versa. The only problem that I have in a little critique is that little locking mechanism that it has for the top lid. It does tend to come off when you do not have your pack, pack fully packed out. So that's the only thing I'm telling Kelty that I wish they would change. Other than that, this backpack is really well made. And right now I believe you can pick this up for like $69.90 something. I will put that in the description. So if you are interested in it, I will have that in the description as well. And I am also going to have this on my Amazon store. So if you want to check that out there, please go ahead. And I do thank everyone that has gone and shopped on my Amazon store. Thank you very much, everyone. Thumbs up to everyone for going over there and checking my Amazon store because it does help support this channel very much. So thank you very much. And everyone, please do follow me on Facebook and Instagram. Please like, share, please comment down below, and please subscribe to this channel. 
And as always, everyone, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you very much. See you later.